I'm Jeremy, and I'm a product specialist at Abstract. And in this video, we're going to take a look at many of the powerful new features introduced in Inslaud Studio 2023. Inslaud Studio 2023 is the next major release of our standalone application, providing you with the best experience when creating scalable workflows to automate the technical aspects of 3D content creation. Previously known as Inslaud Studio XL, Inslaud Studio is packed with powerful new features and numerous improvements. Let's go ahead and dive in. Instalod 2023 adds an assortment of new remeshing modes. Quad remesh reconstructs the mesh so that the topology is constructed entirely with quads. With the edge mode set to automatic, the size of the edges constructing the quads are generated based on the size of the mesh and can be scaled accordingly by adjusting the target edge size parameter. Isotropic remesh reconstructs the mesh so that the edge lengths are a consistent size. This results in a uniform polygon distribution across the topology. Topology such as this is useful for complex calculations for animations and simulations, such as for soft bodies or cloth. Both quad mesh and isotropic remesh with the edge mode set to automatic are scalable mesh operations and will adapt to the size and complexity of the geometry that is being processed. Using the remesher in UV mode creates a new UV layout and bakes new mesh maps while maintaining the original mesh's topology. Setting the remesher to convex hull mode creates a convex hull while also baking down textures from the input mesh. Additionally, the mesh toolkit mesh operation also has a convex hull setting. Use the remesher's convex hull mode to take advantage of the generated baked mesh maps and UV unwrapping. Instalod now has super-fast GPU bakers, which can be utilized in mesh operations such as remeshing, material merging, and imposterization. To access the GPU bakers, choose GPU as the bake engine in the bake settings for the mesh operation in the mesh operation settings panel. In addition, Instalod now has multi-bake support. If a mesh contains multiple assigned materials, baking in multi-material mode will preserve the target mesh's material slots when baking down from the source mesh. Here you can see that our source mesh contains one material while our target contains three. By choosing multi-material as the bake mode, Instalod's bakers will respect the configuration of materials applied to the target while also baking down high poly details. The result is a detailed low-poly model with the texture information of the original source mesh's single material baked into the target set of three materials. The Polygon Optimizer has a brand new feature called Automatic Quality. By selecting an option from the Automatic Quality dropdown in the Optimized settings, a desired level of quality can be chosen for the optimized result. The level of optimization is determined automatically by Instalod, making this a scalable setting that can produce a consistent level of quality regardless of the complexity of the input mesh. Here, you can see that we import a completely different mesh, but keep the automatic quality setting set to normal. The result is an optimization with a consistent level of quality, which is set with a single drop-down menu. Instalod Studio 2023 comes with a completely refreshed UI design. All of the interface elements have received a modern facelift from the buttons, panels, sliders, and tabs. 
panels now have icons that depict their function, making them easier to locate, and vertical space is increased to allow more content on the screen at once. And we've even introduced some new elements, such as our brand new color picker for choosing colors and values for materials and when painting optimizer weights with vertex colors. Mesh operations are now selected from the Mesh Operations drop-down menu in the Mesh Operations Settings panel. Click the drop-down to choose the desired functionality for the active mesh operation. When creating a new profile, a new panel shows all the available mesh operations and workspaces in Instalod Studio. From here, a new profile can be created with the selected mesh operation set as the first operation to perform. Additionally, templates can be created and chosen to get started quickly. The newly designed welcome screen provides quick access to all things Instalod. On the left, profiles and scenes can be created or opened. Below are links to the new documentation and community websites. In the middle are your most recent files, and the right provides quick access to the latest videos on our YouTube channel. Instalod Studio's viewport has received a few updates. The default tone map operator has been set to ACES, and the ambient occlusion channel is now visualized on the mesh. The viewport also features an updated gizmo in the bottom left corner. This gizmo not only displays the current world orientation, but also provides quick orthographic snap points and doubles as a lighting reflection sphere for the viewport's environment map. Material channels can now be soloed from the Render Mode dropdown under Environment Settings in the Viewport Settings panel. This allows for quick visualization of the different material channels such as the Normal, Ambient Occlusion, and Mesh ID map on the surface of the mesh. The viewport now has an updated wireframe rendering feature where the boundaries of a mesh are colored red. This is especially useful when dealing with CAD or scan data, making it easy to detect if patches of the mesh haven't been properly welded together. With the new Python integration, custom plugins can be created for Instalod Studio and Instalod Pipeline to provide extensive customization and increased capability using one of the world's most popular programming languages. Here you can see a plugin with custom UI in Instalod Studio that automatically uses occlusion culling to remove internal geometry and performs a remesh operation. This remesh operation generates additional baked mesh maps which are useful for texturing. The result is an optimized model with a significantly lower poly count and reduced draw calls. And we've only scratched the surface on the many new features and improvements found in Instalod Studio 2023. This extensive release includes updates that span across the entire application, ranging from CAD improvements to multi-threaded UV generation. There's a lot more to uncover. To learn more about what's new in both Instalod Studio and the entire Instalod product line from our massive 2023 release, be sure to check out the link for our release notes in the description below. And for all things Instalod, subscribe here to our YouTube channel. Here we have an ever-expanding library of video content teaching you the ins and outs of Instalod. Well, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, drop us a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe. For the latest news about Instalod, please visit our website and follow us on Twitter. You can find all the links in the video description below. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next one.